Best dual camera with cheapest price. Although the selfie cell phone is still a prima donna on the market, the dual camera smartphone trend is now on the rise where consumers are offered attractive photography features. Even the vendors did not hesitate to introduce and market its newest dual camera smartphone specifically for the Indonesian mobile market. Names like Xiaomi, Samsung, Advan, Oppo have even marketed their dual camera smartphones. Do not want to lose this moment, Motorola ventured to market its newest dual camera smartphone called Moto G5S Plus. Comes with a price tag of 3 million rupiah, this device not only looks neatly on the side of the camera that is implanted but interesting in terms of design and hardware devices embed. Dead. Moto G5S Plus has a sleek design with a build quality that is very good for other Motorola smartphones. This device is wrapped with a metal material body frame with a solid color combination that makes it look charming and elegant. Not only captivating in terms of appearance and implanted material, when holding the Moto G5S Plus Moto 77 enough amazed by the design carried. Comes with rounded corners on each side and a pretty slim body this device is comfortable to use. Although it looks neat in terms of design, but there are things that are quite stumbling for Pulsa, where the rear camera is embedded too prominent and that makes the embedded rear camera vulnerable to scratches. When used, this matter enough to make the Moto 77 worry if the embedded rear camera often bumps when placed. In the Moto 77 sales package, the Moto G5S Plus includes a cell phone, data cable, ejector pin, charger, warranty card and Panduang books. There is also a conventional earphone design in the sales package. Very thing unfortunate is the absence of additional cases in the sales package. Without the presence of additional cases, the consumer must buy it for yourself, which of course has to spend extra money to protect the Moto G5S Plus. Still talking about the design offered, on the interface, this device comes with a screen size of 5.5 inches plus full HD screen resolution. Embedded also the 8 megapixel resolution front camera sensor which is added with lights flash LED to help the lighting. Switch to the right side of the device, the user will find the power button and volume button. While on the left side of the device embedded two SIM card slots, the second SIM card slot can also be used as an additional storage device capacity up to 256 gigabytes. On the back of Motorola puts dual rear camera with 13 megapixel resolution with additional LED flash lights dual tone. On the back of the body there is a firm line that increasingly makes this device look attractive. While at the bottom, you will find the speaker hole and micro USB 2.0 port. As mentioned above, the Moto G5S Plus comes with a 5.5-inch dimension screen panel combined with IPS screen technology plus full HD 1080p screen resolution. In plain view, this behavior is able to present screen quality which is clear but has a slightly too bright screen. The sharpness of the screen is quite slick, which gives convenience when used for watching videos or streaming. Moto G5S Plus comes with the support of the Android 7.1.1 Nougat operating system. For interfaces, this device has pure Android display where this device comes without a custom UI addition. The display is quite simple facilitate its use. This is not much different from other Motorola smartphones that have a stylish look Android 1. The interesting thing is the presence of an application called Moto. This application is not much different from the application present on smartphones in general where this application is present g. Giving users the option to use gestures or gesture to go to a particular application. There are two features embedded in this Moto application, Moto Action and Moto Display. Both of these features are quite interesting which is very helpful for users on the move. Moto G5S Plus comes with Qualcomm MSM8998 Snapdragon 625 chipset as the main support for its performance. Snapdragon 625 embedded in the G5S Plus is an octa-core Cortex-A53 2.0 GHz speed processor. Also included in it Adreno 506 graphics processor. What's more, the embedded chipset is combined with 4 GB of RAM to maximize its performance. As for data storage media, this smartphone is equipped with 32 gigabytes of internal memory. Quite standard indeed with capacity embedded memory where users can only use 22 gigabytes. But if that is felt to be lacking, the user can add it via a micro SD card that shares with SIM card 2 slot. To prove the performance produced, the Moto 77 tried it by playing the Asphalt Extreme game where the game is present with a good Hyungrafis display and requires a powerful mobile performance. Based on the test, Moto G5S. Plus being able to play this game well without any significant obstacles. 
Not only that, the graphic display is owned sharp and has good details. Not much different from a smartphone equipped with a Snapdragon 625 chipset, the Moto G5 S Plus has a very high performing. E good. Through the Antutu benchmark, Moto G5 S Plus gets a score of 63,999. A fairly high score is owned by Moto G5 S Plus at an affordable price. While for the 3D Mark benchmark the score obtained is 463. Moto G5 S Plus offers dual camera functionality at the rear as its main selling point. Dual camera the embedded rear has a resolution of 13 megapixels with f2.0 openings. The dual camera function embedded is not much different from other dual camera rear camera devices which focus on the depth of effect fields where this device is equipped with the ability to present a blur effect on the camera results obtained. Besides mode the selective tool device is also equipped with professional modes and panoramas. When the Moto 77 tries the features embedded in this device starting from the selective tool mode, Moto 77 can determine how much bokeh effect you want to get. This is because this device has special software that can regulate the effect. As for the professional mode, the Moto 77 can be creative by starting the arrangement from shooting speed, ISO range, to the desired focal point. Based on several tests carried out in general, this device is able to present sufficient camera quality good. Bored with the bokeh mode, users can use an embedded front camera to perform various activities such as video calls, selfie actions to live blogging to various social media applications. Other capabilities possessed by Moto G5 S Plus is recording video with 4K resolution. Enter the front camera, the user will be treated to an 8 megapixel front camera plus additional LED flashlights to improve lighting. The quality of the front camera is quite good and has a fairly sharp camera result. Bored with selfie, users can invite friends by using the panoramic selfie feature to get angle broader view. Another reliability that the Moto G5 S Plus camera has is the ability to record resolution videos 4K. Dual camera smartphone competition is currently becoming a trend for now, at the same time as the launch of Moto G5 S Plus there are two smartphones from other vendors that are also sliding on the market. Moto G5 S Plus has the advantage of design which is more charming even though the user must buy additional accessories in the form of soft case or hard case to protect the glass rear camera that is embedded in impact or scratches. For its performance, either Moto G5 S Plus or its PRIC have a performance that is not much different. Another reliability that is present in Moto G5 S Plus is the support of photography features which is quite charming that pampers users in exploring. Best dual camera with cheapest price. Although the selfie cell phone is still a prima donna on the market, the dual camera smartphone trend is now on the rise where consumers are offered attractive photography features. Even the vendors did not hesitate to introduce and market its newest dual camera smartphone specifically for the Indonesian mobile market. Names like Xiaomi, Samsung, Advan, Oppo have even marketed their dual camera smartphones. Do not want to lose this moment, Motorola ventured to market its newest dual camera smartphone called Moto G5 S Plus. Comes with a price tag of 3 million rupiah, this device not only looks neatly on the side of the camera that is implanted but interesting in terms of design and hardware devices embed. Dead. Moto G5 S Plus has a sleek design with a build quality that is very good for other Motorola smartphones. This device